Wow, we're back. We're gonna be starting on Castlevania 1. Push start key. I did it. I pressed the start key. I've seen that intro before because um, it was like a thing of like TAS runs back in the day. Does anyone remember that? That had that as an intro. Hey, I recognize that. That's from Vampire Survivors. <laughs> it's exactly the same sprite from Vampire Survivors. I don't know what like any of this does. I'm assuming the gold is like for score because that's apparently a thing that you need in, in the old games. You know, score was important back in those days. Oh, I got this score score on Castlevania. Oh, you did? Oh man, I'm gonna have to beat that now. That's the axe from Vampire Survivors. It's literally all of the assets from Vamp Survivors copied <laughs> from this. <laughs> Whoa, is that a boss battle? Looks like it. Whoa, what's that? Two. I did like, I'm doing like no damage to this guy. Ah. Okay, it's not looking good for all Zanti boy here. Uh! Oh, continue. What? I have to, oh my I gotta start from the very beginning. I hope I don't have to start from the very start every single time. Here's the plan. I've got the stopwatch. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stop time at the boss when he's in a in a in a goofy spot. Then we can hit the heck out of him. Oh, one more hit. I did it! Oh, I did it. I beat the first boss. <laughs> oh yes. Whew. Tricky, 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 tricky. Alright, what next then? Seems pretty straightforward so far. I like the progression of this game so far. I don't, I don't even know if I'll be able to beat it today. I, I think so, right? But no, the real reason I'm playing this today is because I needed a game that doesn't require clicking. Because I've been playing a lot of games that require a lot of clicking and doing a lot of charting. And my, my index finger is, like, deteriorating. Oh, that is so unfair. <laughs> Come on. Okay, that's how I clear that. Oh no. Oh, there's no mid-air strafing or anything. How how does that kill me? Surely I just returned to the previous screen. It's kind of like Elden Ring in a way, or like a Dark Souls game, right? Because the more you play, the more you kind of learn how to, how to play these next sections of level. You know what I mean? Like you know where the enemies are, where they're going. Their patterns, ways to avoid them. Oh, snap. Okay. We got crushes. That's instant kill? Oh my god. <laughs> Medusa boss. Oh, I did it. Yes. That one wasn't too bad. I feel like the bat was harder because he was just like flying around. I already like this song. Whoa, little gremlin. Oh, the stopwatch is really good. <laughs> I like the stopwatch. I'm so gonna die here. Yep. Oh, come on. Knocked into a pit. I hate that. The knockback when you get hit is so annoying. If only it kept you in the same place. Yeah, it's like you have to kind of predict where the enemies are gonna be rather than where they currently are. Oh, that, that, that drop there is so frustrating. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh. Hey, look at that. The ranged attack. That was beautiful. Okay, we're doing good. We're doing really well. Okay, I don't know what that mummy's doing. Oh, this is the boss. And now I'm dead. This part of the level is dumb. I don't like this stage. <laughs> stage 9 sucks. Well, this is gonna go well. I've gotta no hit the boss. Yep, that was not gonna happen. And now game over. Great. What? The stopwatch doesn't work on them? That's so not fair! That is so not fair that stopwatch doesn't work on those. That is complete nonsense. I can't believe that. My day is ruined. Now I'm just like stuck here. How am I supposed to avoid them? 
They're like on both sides of me. This is this is this is dumb. <laughs> I don't like this game. <laughs> There's a reason they don't make video games like this anymore. It's like if if I get to this point and I die, I'm like I've got no chance. There's no way I can do it because it's like they they give me like no weapons. And by the time I get over there, I've lost all my health because all the enemies are really dumb. Like these Medusa heads or whatever. Ugh. They, they took like no damage from that. Well, it was going well. <laughs> it was going really well. Oh, hey, look, I'm back at the boss, but I have like no health left again. At least there's a health up there. It's not much, but it'll do. Alright, let's give this another go. Stay there! No! Oh, first try. <laughs> How did I do it? I just, oh, I've no idea. It worked though, and I did it. That is such a stupid boss battle. That's the equivalent, if anyone's played Elden Ring, of the Godskin duo. That's basically the Godskin duo of this game. Going well so far. Oh, we got like a cabbage patch. Look at this. Stage 11 is the cabbage level. Whoa. Cabbage farmers. You never want to trust those cabbage farmers. Can we get that as a quote? I hate these cabbage farmers. Ugh. Get out of it. Go get someone else's cabbage. <laughs> I'm just minding my own business. I'm not after your cabbages. Can this skeleton just die? Oh. Like, if I miss one cabbage farmer, it's over. Like, that. that's it. It is painful. <laughs> <laughs> it is painfully hard, this game. It's very, very difficult. I'm I'm having a rough time with it. Can I just walk past this guy? I can. Oh no. The Cabbage Man. Cabbage Man and Cabbage Stein. Oh, I've done it. Oh, that's the trick. That's the trick. You stand by the wall. Oh, you stand by the wall. So stupid cabbage monkey bounces off of it. It's like frustrating. It's like the Dark Souls of its time is the way I would explain this. You know, I've tried Dark Souls 1 and I thought that was relentlessly brutal. But 3 isn't that bad. Yeah, it's frustrating, isn't it? Dark Souls 1. I, which is why I never really played it. I, I, I tried. I really tried. I've given it a try. I've tried it like three or four times. And I'm just like, nah, I'm not doing this. But then I played Elden Ring. And I'm like, Elden Ring is great. I, I really like Elden Ring. So I was like, let's just try Dark Souls 3. A nice, you know, in-between point. And I really am having a good time with Dark Souls 3. But I haven't played it in a while. So I need to go back to it. I'm getting frustrated now. The fact that I'm stuck in this same corridor over and over and over again. There's no safe space. There's no way I can, like, sit in one place. It's like everywhere is dangerous. This is dumb. This is so dumb. <laughs> Just me saying how dumb this game is the entire time, that's what this is turning into. Yeah, 
Yeah, screw this. <laughs> Actual rage quit right there. Screw that. That sucks. I'm not playing that. <laughs> oh, that is so stupid. Right, what do we do now then?